people who not uh, support this war um, uh, for for them in Russia not safe now. Uh, a few years I worked. Uh, no, I wanna speak uh, when I was famous in Russia. Yeah, in th 2011 year. I worked in Russian MTV channel as a TV host. Yeah, in this year I uh, uh, took a part in um, Russian um, opposition um, meet how it's in English opposition uh, protest. protest. Yeah. yeah, in Red Square. Uh, so after this, my boss from MTV, he told me, we don't want to work with you because you don't support Putin, don't support Russian system, so uh, you fired. They, they was fired me just because I took a part in um, this uh, protest. What was the protest about? It, uh, it was protest in Balotna Square uh, against Putin. Okay. Yeah, it, uh, this protest uh, very f is very famous in Russia. It's very, there, there was a lot, a lot of uh, Russian people. So, yeah. In Moscow? In Moscow, yeah. Yeah, and uh, after this, they was fired me, and they started terrible information war against me. They showed me like I'm, I don't know, a monster, stupid girl. So they, uh, it was really, it was, it was really, was very hard for me because. Uh, because of this Russian propaganda, I, I couldn't uh, find a new job for a few years. They wrote articles about me, that I'm stupid, that I am... Uh, they showed me like a monster. <laughs> stupid, uh, dumb girl. Really, a few years, I couldn't find a new job. I, I had a big depression, it was really terrible. And after, after two years, I, uh, I found a new job in another Russian TV channel. I worked as a TV editor in Russian TV um, channel. We created TV program. And then Russian poli poli politics, uh, closed this uh, program and closed this channel. And this uh, because um, it, it was happened because uh, you know, now in Russia have terrible uh, Russian uh, how censorship. Do you understand yes. what is it? Yes. So yeah, now in uh, now. Uh, Putin, Putin just destroyed Russian uh, information, uh, information media because he uh, he built build uh, terrible uh, Russian propaganda and Russian censorship. Yes. In Russia, I had uh, suicide. Just because I had I had terrible uh, depression about this, what happens with me, I have really uh, had I had really terrible depression, and I lay down in uh, Moscow in Moscow in mental uh, hospital. Wow. Yeah, it was uh, it was very hard because uh, in this hospital Russian doctors. They abused me. Yeah, yeah, it, it was very really terrible. Yeah, they abused me. It why, was... why? Why did they abuse you? They, uh, they abused... <laughs> I think they abused 
everyone who lay down in this uh, mental hospital because Russian mental hospital it's really a terrible place really terrible they um, uh, they uh, told me that I uh, must uh, take pills and I asked uh, I don't wanna take pills this and I don't don't wanna mm, that you injection. injection me yeah, yeah. yeah. about this injection uh, I couldn't feel feel my feet so yeah I I asked please uh, can you uh, don't do me this injection please every every morning we, when we um, w wash wash uh, our body, yeah. uh, they uh, stayed and uh, looked at you, and sometimes they uh, they was not just woman, they was just a man too. Yeah. So men would be yeah. Wow. yeah. So uncomfortable. Yeah. Yeah. It was terrible. Yeah, in, two th in 2017 year I emigrated to Ukraine and uh, I worked in Ukraine as a journalist. I wrote article against Putin's system and I... Uh, Is this during the war? During the war? Uh, I work as a journalist in uh, Ukraine, yeah, okay. in Kyiv. And I uh, supported uh, Ukrainian politics, Miss Julia Timoshenko. I know that Putin hates Miss Julia Timoshenko. So yeah, I support her. I uh, I uh, was as a volunteer in her in her political um, party. Uh, I wrote uh, anti-Putin's article. Uh, uh, for Ukrainian media, so I wrote article about uh, Putin's sex party okay. and about the Russian um, Russian uh, politic uh, Mr. Lenin, and I wrote uh, a lot of uh, uh, posts in my Instagram against war. Uh, I left Ukraine. I left Ukraine, uh, how it's in English, when started this big war, I was in Moscow with my family, do you understand me, yeah? Yes. I was, uh, I was with my family, and uh, yeah, I uh, didn't support this war, and uh, after this, yeah. I had a lot of problems. Yeah. <laughs> uh, me called from FSB. And uh, I remember this day, they called me and they, uh, they, uh, they told me, Diana Makiba, I want to speak with you about your article uh, about Putin. You must uh, come to use in general office in Lubyanka Square. We want to speak with you about why you don't support this war, why you write this article. And uh, yeah, in this moment, I understood that uh, <laughs> this is this is end. <laughs> yeah. Uh, that I I must uh, left Russia now. Were you afraid that they would kill you? Yeah, I I af I afraid that they can kill me, and I I afraid they uh, that they can sit me in prison and I. I was afraid that uh, they can sit me in prison and then kill me. <laughs> yeah, I understood and I understand that uh, FSB, Russian Security Service, it's it's really a terrible system. They uh, was sit in prison a lot of people who uh, don't support war. Now in uh, in Russia, uh, sit in prison a lot of people activists, journalists who don't support this war. So it's uh, for people who not uh, support this war, um, uh, for, for them in Russia not safe now. 
I just wanna that Americans know what happens now in Russia with people who don't support this war, don't support Putin's system. Uh, this um, Putin system, it's uh, really, um, it's really a terrible system who destroyed any people who don't want to support them. Right. And I think um, people uh, from the world should know what happens now in Russia, because it's really terrible. I know that um, I know that uh, now in Russia um, sit in prison very famous uh, singer. He's just he's just singer. He uh, didn't support this war and he um, burned down his uh, passport, Russian passport. And then, yeah, and then when he came to Russia, uh, Russian po po policy, po policy, po yeah. Russian policy uh, set in prison. He's, he now, he's sitting in prison just because he <laughs> didn't support this war. Yeah, it was really, uh, yeah, my journey was uh, really, uh, uh, complex because I went to US through Mexico and it's really dangerous. Yeah. Yeah, it's, it's really dangerous. Uh, I sit in uh, immigration prison when I was uh, in American board, b board there, border. Yeah, border. Yeah, where? Uh, yeah, I sat here one month. So it's, 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 it was really hard for me.